bronze medal match, number one, 60 kilos. Petrik for Ukraine. Makaranka for Belarus. Ukraine show the versatility in singlets this week. They are going with their red look for this particular match. Belarus in the gray and sky blue. Two three minute periods for international wrestling. Greco-Roman wrestling with a passivity point that we'll see early and that gives the opponent an opportunity to work part here. We saw a number of turns, a lot of high scoring matches in a continent that is regarded as one of the best in producing the Greco-Roman caliber wrestler. Red head up, blue head up, contact blue. A little more than a minute into this one as we hit the one minute mark now. No score, Belarus and Ukraine. Working off the two-on-one is uh, Petrik for Ukraine. Able to get to this tie, and that's going to create the point for Ukraine as he will get the passivity point in activity and now portier opportunity for uh, Petrik. Let's see what he can do as Makaranka for the first time will go down. You have to keep your arms out. Let the uh, top wrestler get into position. They go with the reverse grip, trying to springboard over the top. He has him airborne all the way over, and he'll get two. Just kind of ran out of real estate. Quick explosion by Petrick, though, with the reverse grip from Parterre. If he had a few more steps, he might have been able to get the full danger exposure for four. Instead, he settles for two, but a good start. And Ukraine has the 3 nothing lead. Red, don't with foot, okay? Hard to imagine we started it all last weekend, all the teams, 37 countries represented at this year's European Championships, 37 countries encompassing 344 athletes. Scoring opportunity here for Belarus, but Petrik is able to get out of trouble. Like for an opportunity, maybe Makaranka might get that slide by or pass by attempt and get control from the back side, but good agility there by Petrik, and now he rips his arm away and it's clear of the Makaranka tie. Pace picking up a little bit toward the tail end of this first period. 3-0 Ukraine out in front. Action red, action blue. Hey, just think of that for a moment. Freestyle had the uh, largest field of competitors. And then you look at the Greco-Roman side with 77 competitors entered in this year's European Championship. Truly really is a two-day grind. There is no rest for the weary. You win, you wrestle right away, you lose. You hope for an opportunity to come back and wrestle. And the Repishar set. First period highlights belonging to Ukraine and Viktor Petrik. This was the two-pointer. After getting the passivity point, he wasted no time with the reverse grip, able to get the two on the toss. Makaranka having a tough time getting his offense started. The young Belarus wrestler coming back out, down three, nothing. But you saw him get to a couple of ties, pretty strong ties toward the latter stages of that first period. Let's see if he can go right back to work and try to keep that pace going. I like what I saw from him over the final 30, 35 seconds. Good job here by the Ukrainian Petrik. He's back in on the two-on-one as the Russian tie. Right arm of Makaranka tied up, squeezing tightly. Makaranka trying to get that arm clear, unable to free it yet. Now he does. Digging in with a right side underhook is Petrik. He just continues to dictate the flow. So he's kind of come back and taken over the gauntlet as far as dictating the match a little bit. 
Makaranka is going to have to work a little bit harder to stay out of some of these ties. Back in on that two-on-one, and now the referee will come in and stop it. He's going to give the passivity point to Makaraka, so a chance to operate part here. See if he can get the two back or more that he gave up in the first period. Swallows up the waste of Petrick. He's on the left side of the body. Now comes back in between the legs. Isn't really getting much done here. Precious time uh, wasting away, and it will be a missed opportunity for Makaranka from top. Unable to get the turn from Partier. Three to one. Petrick. Maintains the lead inside two minutes to go. First of two bronze medal matches here tonight for Warsaw. <laughs> Patrick obviously with a much better and more opportunistic quartier position so far. Makaranka. <laughs> Free up his right arm. Petrick has made a living just putting the clamps on the right arm. Hasn't been able to get any type of uh, offensive motion with it, but he is setting up the tie-up, and he is keeping Makaranka from his offense and getting to where he wants. Belarus tried the arm throw, came up empty, so both wrestlers back to their feet. Inside a minute to go. Final period, three to one. Low scoring bout to kick off our coverage tonight. Saw Makaranka for a brief moment. Looked like he might be able to get his hands locked, maybe a body lock position. Looks like he's trying to get back in there, but Petrick doing a real nice job. Just keeps changing it up. Really tying up Makaranka so he can't get into that offensive mode that he so desperately needs to. Here's a big headlock throw attempt. He had to take a shot, doesn't land it. Petrick lands on him, gets two, and that should seal it. Victor Petrick in a real good position now, leading 5-1. Doesn't want to really try to turn him from this position with just six seconds left. And Ukraine will earn the Knights' first bronze medal, and it's Biktor Petrik with a 5-1 bronze medal performance. Ukraine in the tally sheet tonight. Thank you. 